In this video, I'll show the changes for Overgrowth Alpha 141, which you can try if you've pre-ordered. This week I worked on gameplay infrastructure, starting with script trigger volumes. These are shapes that send an event to the level script when entered by a character. For example, I can place a level end trigger to represent the endpoint of a race or exploration challenge. Triggers will be useful for level objectives, checkpoints, dialogue, and many other spatial events. The triggers use a simplified collision world that just contains character spheres, so I thought I would try using that for field of view checks as well. These checks can use manually defined field of view models, so we can easily control how far characters can see in each direction, and even add special shapes for helmets and other view restrictions. <laughs> To make the combat system easier to understand, I added a flinch animation if you attempt an active block when nobody's attacking. This makes it easier to see how the timing should work, and how nothing happens if you try to spam the block button. The enemy characters use the same system with human-like reaction time, so they're a lot more likely to counter slow attacks than quick ones. That's it for this week. If you'd like to pre-order and try the alpha for yourself, you can do that at wolfire.com slash pre-order. If you'd like to hear about development news as soon as it happens, you can follow me on Twitter at Wolfire.